Good morning, you guys. Today is Wednesday, August 7th, 2013. I'm a bit sore today. My arms are sore. Uh, my sides are sore. They were a bit sore when I went to bed. Chest is okay, but it's also a little bit sore. Neck's a little sore. But it's to be expected, so it's fine. I'm good with that. Yeah, there's a lot of weight working for um, I'm also a bit tired. I should have gotten a bit a little earlier last night. But that's okay. Um, otherwise, I feel pretty good. So, time to get my day started. Just me. I have flaxseed oatmeal. It's, it's nature's past uh, organic oatmeal. Flax plus flavor. It's absolutely delicious, and I'm looking forward to eating it. Goody, goody, good gumdrops. Good for the tummy breakfast. Hey guys, just so you know, I saw 149.4 this morning, which is the lowest I've ever been in this journey. Um, I hesitate to say that I'm definitely on a losing trend because I'm a lo I'm I'm not sure that I am. You know, until I see it go below 149, I'm like, I believe that I'm on the losing trend yet. I'm not still in the same place because, you know, just because I went a little bit below 150 doesn't mean that I, eh, I'm definitely on a losing trend unless the scale continues to go down. Um, I suspect I am, but I'm gonna not jinx it. I basically, I figure we'll see what happens. Um, last night after my shower, my legs were really itchy. Um, that's actually a good sign. It may, it may mean that my, uh, I may be losing some weight on my legs, which, and, you know, muscles are changing, which is a very good thing. And they've been a bit achy, which is also a good sign. It means that the, the muscles are making some changes. And I think I'm seeing changes, but I'm not sure. I'm hoping. i really, really hoping. Um... But yeah, now I'm getting my day going. I'm, I had my breakfast, which I really enjoyed, by the way. And, like, right after I told you what I was eating, my stomach growled, and then I just inhaled it. It was so good. <laughs> anyway, that's it for now. Just me. Hey, guys, I just did cardio one. Um... And my heart rate monitor is so full of shit. It says 89 calories, but I know I fucking did more than that. It kept saying my heart rate was way lower than it really is. It's like saying things like 54 and 20, 49. I'm wondering if the battery's dying or if just the thing, period, is dying. But I do know I'm going to have to stop using it for a couple days because these numbers are bullshit. I know I'm doing better than that. So I'm just going to, you know put down whatever you know I'm gonna use whatever numbers are there like today is 193 and considering my last numbers was like 170 something that's pretty close so I'm gonna go with that and I feel like I did a pretty good job today I'm covered in sweat from head to toe you know including my scalp my legs my arms everything's sweaty so I know I did a good job um so yeah, I'm just going to go with that. And either get a new one this weekend via mail or look into getting a new battery for the uh, heart rate monitor itself because I think that's what's broken. I think the watch itself seems to be okay. I, I think it's the heart rate monitor that needs a new battery. If it's not too expensive, basically I'm going to look and see how much heart rate monitors are and then I'm going to find out how much the... Uh, battery is, and whichever is cheaper, that's what I'm going to try for next. But for the next two days, I'm just going to go by whatever my fitness pal says for whatever I'm doing. So, I'm a little tired. <laughs> I'm still sore, like the back of my arms. Sorry. Back of my arms, like right back here. Hopefully you're seeing what I'm trying to show you. Hurts. Um, legs last night, as I mentioned, were very itchy, so I know the muscles are changing back there. Um, 
I have noticed that my belly is looking different. I think it's tightening up a bit. I'm hoping that that change will continue. Oh, mostly I'm just tired. And I'm feeling better about my food. I think I've been making progress and getting things back to a better place rather than eating a lot of junk. Uh, I think that's it for now. So, I'm just me. I'm having a peanut butter nom nom now just because I need to eat something because I'm getting lightheaded. Hungry! Probably gonna have a half a grapefruit in a little bit too. I decided to have a plout instead of a grape, half a grapefruit. So, plout time. Noms! My lunch is three egg whites and ten raw baby carrots and two uh, pieces of uh, banana bread with a minuscule amount of butter on them. Nom! Tonight, today's afternoon snack, which I really need because I'm really sleepy and I kind of fell asleep in my chair, is 22 raw almonds. Nom! I like raw almonds. I'm actually looking forward to this. Nummies! I kind of need the, um, like the healthy fats too, so that's also why I'm eating the raw almonds. So yeah, hey, for healthy fats and protein. This is like six grams of protein. Oh wow, just in these almonds. So, naham. So my daily goal for water is usually at least two of these. Now keep in mind, this is 32 ounces of water, just in this one water bottle. Okay, so two of these is 64, which is the nor would normally be eight. 8 ounce glasses, which is your typical everyday amount of water you should be getting daily. And then usually I'll have one large glass of tea, but today for some reason, and then usually a smaller uh, glass of hot tea. That's that's my typical day. Well today, I have had, this will be my third one. I'm almost done with this one as you can see. Let's see, it's almost gone. Plus I've already had one glass of hot tea. So, wow, I'm drinking a lot of water today. I don't know, for some reason I'm just really into the water. So yeah, lots of water today. Tonight's dinner is, this is, believe it or not, one-fourth of a cup when it's dry, of wild rice and one chicken breast. That is my dinner tonight. Nom. And it's my favorite time. It's popcorn time. I heart popcorn. Yes, I do. It's so delicious. Good old healthy pop, jiffy pop. No. Final yummy food for me today is a piece of banana bread with a little bit of butter. No.